This is a video about column method, no regrouping in addition. So this method is useful when we're looking at larger numbers and how to work them out. So if we do the arithmetic question of 642 plus 22, the first thing I'm gonna do is look at that number. I can see that it's got six hundreds, four tens and two ones, plus two tens and two ones. So I can then lay out the number just like this. I need to put the larger number at the top. This just makes it easier for setting out and to make sure that there's no mistakes. Now, I can put the HTO at the top just to make it clearer where my place value goes. I make sure the operation, which is the plus minus times symbol there so I can see what I'm trying to work out. And then I need to do two straight lines underneath as equal signs. So I'm going to put my answer in between the two equal signs. Then I'm going to look at my ones column. I always, always, always need to start on the right hand column at my ones because otherwise my answer is going to be wrong. So I look at my ones and I know that two plus two is four. So I write four underneath it. And I move over to my tens column and I know that four plus two is six. Write that in the equal sign. And then I pop over to my hundreds. Now, it's six plus nothing. Now, zero is still a number, so six plus zero, yep, goes down there. So now I know the answer is 664. And that is as simple as that. It's column addition with no regrouping.